The buffalo ain't hitting at all. I haven't had one, not one buffalo bite. He's called a little white bass or a crappie. I like when the buffalo are hitting crankbaits and they're just not doing it. I can probably get one on a worm. There we go. Oh yeah, buffalo. Right when I said that, then one hits. That's freaking weird, man. No, it's a freaking giant. What the hell? It's a white bass, but he's black. A black white bass. Okay. <laughs> I'm, man, that's a big old white bass, man. Yeah, he's completely smoke colored. That might be a freaking hybrid, dude. It's awful big for a white bass. Holy weird, man. It looks like a drum almost. The stripes are gone. That's a freaking 18 inch white bass. Look at that white bass. <laughs> He's black. I thought it was a drum. It might be a hybrid, it just real faded stripes. It's at least 17 inches, but I'm thinking 18. That is not, look at his fins. Half his fin is missing. Weird. It's real scrawny too. Half of its fin mi is missing. White bass. Well, guys, we are not sure if this is either a big white bass or a hybrid. It's smoke colored and it has no visible stripes showing at all. And then half of its top dorsal fin is missing. Half of its dorsal fin is gone. Maybe a gar got a hold of him or something. Something's wrong with him. He's real scrawny. Real sick looking. And you don't. It's not that. It's, if it was mean? a hybrid, his stripes would show all the way. It's not a, to the tail. A tag. No, it's just rotten. <laughs> that thing is big, man. Looks like a tag. I'm gonna show Virgil. That's weird. Looks like a tag. Look at this, man. You can't see the stripes whatsoever, and then he's gray, and then half his dorsal fin's rotten off, and he's real scrawny. Holy crap. Yeah, look at that That's a freaking 18 inch white bass, though. If it was a hybrid, his stripes would be really, you can't even see his stripes. You can see why he's I thought it was a drum. Freaking... Gar he something. looks unhealthy. That's big, though, for a white bass, as big as they get. Gosh. I've never caught one on a crankbait that big like that. Not a big old wide crankbait. Finally got something, man. Just takes patience sometimes. I'll give up here at nine o'clock and try Mingo. But what if Mingo don't look good? I don't know. I need to try worms here, to be honest. Up in there, you get hung a lot, but you catch all kinds of crap. No, it's not a tag, it's just rotten. That's an 18 inch white bass though. God, I've only caught four or five of them that big in my life of that kind. One of them was at the coal mines when I was with Virgil. Was freaking I, so big I thought it was a hybrid. All right guys, Wilma's got a gar on down here. Looks like she got it by herself. I don't like using the dip net on them things. But uh, I don't know if it's a spotted or a long nose. Oh, it got off. Nah. I'm just gonna use gloves. That's a spotted. Oh my gosh, she may have a record, Virgil. I'm not kidding. Record's 34 and a half. Oh, my dang tape measure's up there. Hey, you want to get my tape measure out of there? 
Yes, it is, and that might be a record. You may have a record. I don't know if he's 34, but it's close. Get the... He's getting the tape measure. No. Not bad, though. 32. No. 32. Why is it twisting? You need to up the head. No matter what you do, it's 32. Okay. Still a nice, damn close. Two and a half inches off from the record, guys. Give me my scissors. Record is 34 and a half, currently standing. Get a good shot of his head in the spots. From Whitworth, yeah. You cannot see it because it's the sun is in Yeah, here. you're on the wrong side of me. Oh. Don't stick my piece in pool. Okay. Shoot the head. Okay, now to show me before I lose him. 32 inch spotted gar, guys. Okay. Got it. Nasty freaking gloves. Alright, Virgil just caught a large mouth on a Strike King red eye. Ain't that what they're called, red eye shad? Uh, yeah, actually, I think so. I think it's the ones we got when we were down in. Uh... Tell you what, hold it with that in there. Keep keep the lure in it. Oh, uh, it won't work. It's all messed up. Never mind. All right. Heck yeah, man. It's not a bad fish. <laughs> At least we all got something, right? Didn't strike out anyway. Oh man, that's a long nose. Yep. Yeah. Long nose. Is that the same uh, rainbow you got the other one on? Yeah. It's like rainbow. It's like blue, red, green, yellow. Grab your that one. Grab that body. The whole body. Ah. God. He got out on his own. He wanted to commit suicide. <laughs> Oh, it broke. All right, get, get, ah, damn it. Get my pliers. Get my pliers. Put, put in here on the top. Ow. <laughs> you little bastard. God. I hope I didn't just, I don't hope I ain't got my wallet in my pocket. Okay, good. Get my get my pliers. No, they didn't. It didn't get up that high. It's in between my knees and my pocket. Second pocket. Over thirty-two, I think. All right, guys. Long nose, about thirty inches, thirty-two. All right. Don't put it yet. Don't put it yet. Okay. Put in here. Put in here. Hold it. I can't. Okay. That's about as close as you can get to losing a fish. See? It's 34. 34. Yeah, 34. 34. I wish that's the... Alright guys, I just hooked a nice large mouth. I thought I had a bowfin until he came to the top. He's a four pounder. Oh my gosh. I can pull him up. He's hooked good enough. 
I hate doing it, but. Oh my gosh. That's five pounds. That's a five pound bass. Oh my gosh. Guys on the six cents crankbait that's a red crawfish with an orange bottom. Here, film me. Let me get a little slack line out though real quick. My God, I thought for sure that was a bow fin. That really helped the day turn around right there. Look at that. Boy, Virgil would be mad that he went home now. My friend just went home. If he only knew. Got a feeling out. Oh yeah, he's gonna see the picture. Nice five pound bass guys on the six cents. That's a total, that's the biggest bass I've ever caught out of this system. My gosh. Is it showing the, everything? Yeah. That's a chuckle crab. <laughs> don't look right the way you're... Why does your camera get black on the top and below? Because it's on widescreen. It won't when I put it on the computer. Okay. It's better quality. You need to pull up a little bit. Do it like that. It's in HD, that's why. It's on 1080p. Here we go. Nice one. That is a tank, man. Yep. Maybe they want that. Look at that. <sighs> tell, tell him if you want that. No, it's okay. I'm going to put him over here. The more they are, the, the more they bite. It's, it's when it's so hot you can barely stand to be out here is when they go crazy. <laughs> Beer and bass. Nether bass. My goodness. Nether largemouth, guys. Man. Look at that. Nether, he's about a pound. Catching the wrong kind, but hey, it's something. I was gonna hold it with the lure in its mouth, but all right. All right, guys, another bass, about a pound. I'm gonna throw him back. Small, too small to eat. Man. Another bass. What is the deal with the bass? It's the third one. I'm not even trying for bass though. If I was, I wouldn't be getting any probably. All right, guys, third largemouth on the six cents. They're loving that crawdad. That red color and dingy water out outperforms. Alright guys, Will was on our first bow pin, I think it's what it is. Is that what it is? Yeah. Okay. It's a big one. Yeah. It's almost full me. Oh my god. Mm. I thought it broke your line. Oh my goodness. This is a big one. Yeah, it is. She's got a big one, guys. Just let him get tired. He'll get tired. Don't go to that. Trees. Uh. It's not real big. Oh my gosh. Not bad, though. 
Yeah, he is pretty big. Took long enough. Man. Go ahead and put the gloves on. I'll get this out. <coughs> Maybe use the fish grippers I can get them out. Alright guys, nice bow fin. I'm going to say he's about mid-20s, 25-ish. Don't worry about measuring. He's about 24, 25. I got it. I Put your hood it. down. <laughs> Put your hood down. Nice bow fin, guys. A little bit down, right there. Alright guys, hey, it's a start. Got the nice large mouth and the bow fin, the white bass, and some gar. Not a bad day. Okay. Nah. Alright guys, I got something I haven't caught in a long time and I love these things. A brown bullhead when they are in full spawn. They got that digital camo appearance. Wow. You definitely gotta get a picture of me holding this. Look how cool that one is. The digital camo, remember? Look. That is cool looking, almost like a flathead, but without, without the flathead. That's why my line's swirling. Well, I guess I'm going to have to have frickin' pliers. Well, come film me. <clears throat> yeah, guys, I was kind of wanting one of these now that I think about it. Not a bunch of them, but I'd like to catch one like I did. They are a cool fish for a bullhead. They're the coolest one. Broke my dang hook with the pliers. All right, here. Broke my damn hook. Now I gotta go to the van and get a new hook. And I got slime all over me. All right, guys, I caught a brown bullhead. I actually like these things. They are a cool fish. Okay. Is it showing me and the fish? Yeah. Even that boys. They're cool looking. Oh, I think they look cooler than a flathead. I see. What a cool fish, guys. Talk about pretty.
All right, guys, I got the biggest brown bullhead I have ever seen in my life. It is humongous for a brown bullhead, I'm telling you. That's the biggest one I've ever seen. Oh my God. Oh my God. Whoa, look at that. Oh my God. Holy cow, man. I gotta make sure I'm recording. Yep, then I'm gonna get a drink after this fish. That is a giant for that kind. They only get like three pounds. He's gotta be damn near too. Oh man, he's making it hard. Well, thank God there's a napkin here. I'm gonna use it. You may have gotten one this big before, but they get bigger though. I know it ain't a record, but it is, a, it's up there. That's a nice bullhead, guys. What a tank. Okay. Anyway, guys, this is my personal best brown bullhead. I accomplished something today. Another personal best. That's my sixth one this year. Okay. Six personal best in one year. Yeah. I'm gonna wait just to see and then pull it up on my phone what the record is. Two point oh nine. God, a two pound bullhead. <laughs> That's big for one of them. I'm tired of my freaking hook pliers cutting the hooks. It used to be the blue ones, now it's those two. All right, guys, I just caught another largemouth on the six cents. Ridiculous. Are you even looking at the screen? Boy, they're just on fire for okay, right now it. for some reason. Guys, I landed another freaking largemouth on that wall. I don't have that pliers. Yeah, off and on they go on spurts. The bass are biting better than the bowfin. I've caught like nine of these. I caught a five pounder behind here. Really? Man, I'm not it's I think you have to use red as the is the secret though. If you got anything red. You uh, uh six cents crawdad looking thing. Red and orange. <sighs> Whew. Another three pound bass, man. Good guy. No, it's about a pound and a half. Not bad. 
That's eight bass I've caught. <laughs> God. <sighs> Crazy, man. Stop it. Dude, all right, all right. Mother. If you'd stop, I'd take you off. Oh my. Nice bass, guys. Pound and a half, anyway. Oh my god. Honey. <laughs> Hey! Hey! Yeah, big, a bigger one too. Here, show me. You got my scissors again. Right here. There's another bus in here. All right, guys, another two pounder anyway. All right, that's good. Yeah. I'm gonna use a worm. Uh -huh. Bring it. Well, this ain't going to be easy. <clears throat> I knew this was going to happen. <laughs> uh, tell myself it's a dumb idea to fish over here. What do I do? Oh, let's go fish over here. Oh my goodness. I did it the dumb way, but it didn't break my rod. <laughs> Man. Nine misses. Took me about three hours. He's a small guy, about 23 inches, probably 22. Finally. All right. I'll get her back. I'm done. We've been fishing since five in the morning. Really? <laughs> yeah, that's why I said I'm done. I haven't ate nothing or anything. Uh, it's not a good. All right, guys. This bow fin's about 25 inches. 
try to lower your fingers you're covering almost a lot of the fish mm. not bad guys just like that hold that pose there we go good fish yeah Now the dip net's gonna stink. Where did you put that? The what?